in the dungeon of CR Machine. We're making making these parts right here. This is a GoPro camera and I can't tell if it's focused. These are Model T parts. There's going to be part of the radiator support bolts. And uh, here's my nice hard inch machine doing the last machining step threading. And now the cutoff. So it took me about a day to set this up. <laughs> and unfortunately, it's not the most reliable job. It requires a lot of babysitting because it's 1018. It's not a free machining. You know, it's not a leaded alloy screw, screw machine stock it has to be brazed so it had to be 1018 and uh, so so that was the first step the stock stop and now we're doing the rough uh, hollow mill right there it's got three cutting teeth low speed low feed that's what steel likes and it's 1018, so you can see it's really, really hard to control the chips. Stringy chips. That's, that's what makes this uh, a babysitting job. You gotta babysit the machine a lot. There's the rough. And now you can see both cross slides, front and rear, are engaging into the part and the, the turret. So it's got one, two, three, four form tools engaging the workpiece now. Forming the, uh, relieving the back end of the part and forming the contour of the bolt head. It's like a carriage, carriage bolt head and putting the 60 degree uh, joint there that will be brazed with a rod after. So once you set up a machine like this, you don't want the tool bits to get dull. You do everything you can to protect the tool bits because setting it up takes a long time. This is a finishing adjustable hollow mill. It finishes the, uh, the, the fastener. It's a 3 8 24 thread. So it finishes the outside diameter of the thread. And then we're relieving that hole right there. Part of the brazed connection will be the brazed connection. And then we, I found that it's good to do the front cross slide with these forming tools again, just to make sure it's to size. I've been having a little bit of trouble with consistency on that. See, it took a little bit more off. There it is. Now, last step, threading. Very rapid threading operation with that die head, a JNL die head, one of the finest quality die heads on the planet. Of course, JNL, Jones and Lamson from Springfield, Vermont, went out of business in uh, the late 90s. I went to the auction actually all right and there we go new part new part started and here's the old part shiny threads nice shiny part out of 1018 steel yep
inside the CR Machine Dungeon.